So one of the coolest features we have on a majority of our Android phones is basically the ability of finding our clipboard inside of our Android phone. So what this means is anything that we have saved inside of our clipboard, I think it saves it for the last like duration of time. So whether it's like an hour or a day or forever, I don't know. It totally depends on how you set up your Android phone. You can still access your clipboard and all the things that you have copied for the last little bit of time. So what this looks like is, and this works for specifically for Gboard, but if you use the Samsung keyboard and most other keyboards, this should also work as well. So what you can do is you can make your way over into a text box. So in this case, I have my text box right here. Now, when you take a look at this you know, specific keyboard, I'll go and take a look and I'll just go and zoom in. You can go and see that there's a lot of things going on with your particular keyboard. But there's, also, there's usually always a little top row. What you want to do is look out for a little notepad icon like this. Like I said, a lot of other keyboards you know, may be a little bit different, but they should always have that type of you know, layout right there. What you can do is you can tap on that particular notepad and you should automatically see a bunch of different text and things on your particular notepad right here. So what you can do is you can see all the recent text and all the things that you've recently added. So if I go and make my way over to my top text box, right? And if I go and say something like, if I go and say like T top, whatever, right? It doesn't really matter. Well, what I can do is I can go and copy this text, right? If I go and tap here, click copy, and you can see it's automatically copied. I can go and hop out of my keyboard. I can paste this thing too. I can just delete it, whatever, it doesn't matter. But then when I go and hop out of this keyboard, and let's just say I hop out of it and I go back into it, right? The keyboard, let's say I just drop it or whatever. If I go back into my standard keyboard, if I click on that notepad icon again, you can see that my text is copied there. So that is basically how you can see your you know, clipboard inside of your Android phone. On top of that, if you want to have customized clipboards, you can tap into this pencil icon right here, and you can even delete certain things if you want to. You can even add a particular item right here too. So if you want to delete these tips, you can just click here, click delete. But you can also click on the pencil icon right here, and you can also click on the plus icon, and you can add a new item here too. So it's just always permanently going to be inside of your thing. So if I want to just type in whatever I want to, I can just go and add that in, click save, and that will always be pinned and that will always be saved up here. So that is basically how you can find your specific clipboard on your Android phone and kind of how to use it. It's pretty basic. It doesn't really take too much time to use. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.